Okay. Uh, OBS. Please capture our factor two. Thank you very much. Okay. Now I did do some 1992 um, stuff. Some F1. Um, what's another good one to try? I could actually do. There's a Brabham, which is very, very cool. Um, what's the other one that I've got installed? Got. Is it this one? I can't remember. The Martra. Now this sounds awesome. So this originated as a um, uh, an original car, but someone tweaked it and put a wing on it and and turned it into a what's called a Martra. I think that's the way it's called. You can have several different um, configurations of it. I quite like the one with the front and rear wings on it. Um, and there's a track that um, is technically, uh, what do they call it? They call it uh, 3PA, which is third party um, third party uh, production of a, a, an add-on which which is kind of vetted by them um, tempted to, to go to, Mon um, to Monaco <laughs> um, but I'm going to show you Longford um, because Longford is quite special Um, I'm going to put a practice session on so I can show you. Um, I think I've left, no I've not left my weather running. I'm not quite sure what time it is in the, in the, um, in Australia at the moment. But because uh, this track is in Australia, it shall get get the weather straight from that track. It's like country roads, basically. Um, and I always end up accidentally um, ending up in a field, or in some hay bales, or in a ditch. And you'll see why. Is this Jackie Stewart's car? Is this the one he raced in? This is one of those legendary tracks. That, um, you know, R Factor One had had their own, and you know these the you can see the um, the fences and things like that. They're just too perfect. They should have sort of slight bends in them and things. So it says. Track temperature 16 degrees. What have we got? It's light and cloudy. Shall I sprinkle some rain on it? Just, just for fun. Oh dear, look! The clouds have come over and it seems to be raining. <laughs> But you can do that with this weather plugin that um, the um, I think it's called Gerald created. Um, but it's 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 awesome. It's just like a country road in Australia that uh, this chap made. I don't even know if this is actually an official. Um, track, or you know, someone just said, Right, I'm just gonna do my local country roads in Australia. 
and uh, and yeah, the rain should uh, stop soon, hopefully. And uh, I'm hoping to create some kind of add-ons for for this game. I'm a, I'm kind of like a track person myself, um, and I want I want to do do the same. I want to make some country roads local to me, but there's nothing really that exciting that I'd want to build. You know, nothing that I've got got access to. Um, Ambient temperature zero. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully that gets the the rain to stop. There we go. Now what they've done, I think, the the rain is completely dynamic, and the cars running in the rain is completely dynamic. So the cars will dry the line, but I'm not sure there is a, there is um, evaporation worked in yet. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to soften it all the way don't know what happens if you actually detach the front and rear um, I'm going to put wet tyres on not that it really matters I'm going to knock the pressures down and if you haven't actually seen it, these these um, R Factor Two has has a tire deflection, tire leave the front on. Okay, I'll leave the front on. Probably won't make any difference to my driving. You do know that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice touch to have all those old, old cars there, but it should have a bit more going on. You know, there should be people having picnics and, and taking photographs and stuff like that. <sighs> that was close. Ow! I think I just got to hit up the rear this then. Sometimes you have to move the mirrors depending on what position you are in the cockpit. That sound. <laughs> See, look, dry lines appearing already. get um, 3D audio from, from the arm coat things like that and the mirrors need adjusting on this car because you can see how large and how thick I let this guy past the guy is in my mirror go past then Jesus an invitation I'm scared to press the throttle down. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> uh, rain spray is not showing in the um, the visor. <laughs> How weird is that? I wouldn't dare do a race like this. I wouldn't last five minutes. The end problem with this bit is knowing where the breaking point is. I keep forgetting where he is. I can't pick it. Right, well that was a lap. No, no, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> I'm <beached> on a <laughs> Typical, isn't it? Typical. I'm I'm gonna make one lap if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> and then we're gonna draw the next key from the the hat. <laughs> right. I like the I like the Dunlop tires look how dirty they look and used. The um, surface of them look a bit too new. It needs a bit more variation. Um, but it's a stunning car. It's not very uh, helpful pit exit. What I want to be able to do is put, um, make some asset packs for track builders so that they can kind of pick stuff so they don't have to build it again like, oh I want an Armco barrier, oh I want some hay bales. Now I might end up doing that, and, uh, instead of creating a track I might end up just creating Assets. I think this this uh, car has tyre flat spotting, so you can turn your tyres into 50 bent pieces if you really want to. front of you. That's the field I normally end up in. Because I forget where the breaking point is. If in doubt, break where the big red house is.
Is that it? My engine's gone. Am I not going to be able to complete one single lap? <sighs> Save me. I'm going to do this if it bloody kills me. I like more uh, the the tracks that are more suited to these cars, the old the old circuits, like the old Spa and Rouen that I did earlier. They have a bit more character. What I'd like to do is. Take a take a modern circuit. Let's let's for example say Magni Core, and then kind of strip it out, keep the same layout, but turn it into country roads, as if it's like roads that would be used for traffic. I'd like to see how that experiment would go. Doubt break at the big red house. Within doubt break at the big red house. I'd like to create um, a series of cars like this where we race just the old circuits. So we've got uh, this, this kind of track. We've got Spa 1967, uh, which is this three and a half minute track. And we've got uh, Rouen in France, which is from the 1950s, 60s, and 70s. Um, I think we've got Zandvoort in Holland. Where is the breaking point? Where is the breaking point? I'm going to break there. I have no clue where it is. Right. Right. <laughs> timed lap. I'm going to make a timed lap. It's probably not a good idea. Now I don't know whether some of this rain has disappeared because of the cars or whether it, it has got some kind of evaporation because if it was like 30 degrees the rain wouldn't stick around for very long would it? Imagine being a like an owner of one of these houses and having cars racing past your windows. Break at the big red house. See the concentration in the face. I'm obviously breaking way earlier than the AI is. We're nearly there. Only a few corners to go. I've made a lap! 
Okay. Hurrah! Oh yes, old Monza. That's another good one. So you got Spa, uh, Monte Carlo. So you got a 1960s version of that. Uh, Rouen. You got this one. You got Monza. So that's five at least. You never know. He might win. You never know. As long as the the key gets used, it doesn't really matter. Um, the only thing I ask is that you don't sell them, because that would be stupid. Okay. Now, all that fun, someone else could be doing the same things as I am. So how many people have entered? Uh, we've got seven. Seven people! Hooray! Okay, I'm going to stop entries. Drum roll, please. Drum roll, please. Have I got any sound effects? I don't think I do. What sound effects do I have? Hmm. Should try some of these out. I haven't um, gone through these in ages. Have you tried turning it off and on again? That's one of my favourites. Okay, drum roll, please. And bigger winner. And the winner is Turga Junior. Targa Junior. Turga Junior. Well done, Turga Junior. He was probably the latest coming to the stream. <laughs> it always works that way though no. so that's the fourth key gone I've still got three more to give away um, so there's plenty of more plenty more I might actually pick another winner as the six of you here um, ok so Turga Junior please send me a PM on Twitch and I will send you out this key when I receive it. Da, da, da. And let's see if Twitch actually does its thing. I haven't tweeted in a while. I should really, because it's all good fun. Um, da, 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 da. If you have any spare cash, it doesn't matter how much it is. Could be a dollar, could be a pound whatever it is if you if you appreciate what I'm doing and staying up for 24 well it's not 24 yet but two and a half hours to go if you appreciate what I'm doing send um, send uh, a couple of coins to my chosen charity which is Cancer Research UK um, I've unfortunately been uh, not myself being the victim of cancer but I've had a lot of people around uh, me you know relations and friends that have unfortunately died of cancer um, so give what you can it was all, all going to a good cause um, you know, also gift aid if you're actually able to if you're not doesn't matter um, Delete that one. Da, 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 da. So that's three down, three to go. Mm. 
Okay. Do, 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 do. One of the best mechanics I've ever known died of cancer this year. That's a real shame. It seems to be, um, I don't know, maybe because we are, it's just that our generation are, are, are dying off kind of a bit young, really. They shouldn't be dying at, at this age. David Bowie. Um, and there was a couple of others earlier this year. Um, really unfortunate. Uh, okay, I got your PM, and I'm going to send you across a key. Do, 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 do. Please tell me I haven't been sending out the wrong keys. Anyway, <laughs> they'll soon find out because they would <laughs> put the code in and say, "I've got R factor one." What the fuck? Um. Okay, so, um, let's not post that in chat, that would be a stupid idea, wouldn't it? I've got so many bloody windows open. I'm taking it, you know how to redeem it. Okay. Is there anyone new to the stream that's just come in? Anyone new to the stream? Good boy. Good boy. Well, I don't even know you if you're a boy, do I? <laughs> okay, is there any more people on the stream that hasn't joined? I think we've got five, so that might be all of you. Okay, I'm going to roll the dice and I'm going to pick another winner. Just to see if you're all awake. Are you all awake? I am, only just. If you've already entered, you don't need to enter again. That's fine. Okay, let's pick another winner. Riot Man! Riot Man, send me a PM on Twitch. And you have the fourth five people left in the list with is that the fourth key that's gone? it is the fourth key five people with two keys available well done right man show me uh, send me a PM on Twitch and I will send you a key back. Uh, whilst I've got the email open. Is there any other games that you guys play? Any other racing games you enjoy? I know that um, the Xbox conferences were kind of harping on about cross-platform play. So basically the Xbox is going to be cross-platform with a PC you'll play with a PC and vice versa um, uh, I wouldn't say <laughs> you say that now <laughs> but you'd probably be the next one coming out of the hat <laughs> Assetto Corsa had a go at that today uh, that's always good fun it, it feels a little different um, and Automobilista is just getting better and better um, but I just I really wish they would move to the R Factor 2 engine because it's got so much promise. Their their dev team are so talented. The where they've taken R Factor 1 and you know they they bought the source code from from ISI and they they've just taken it to you know where R Factor didn't. So 
but uh, any time that I do these streams, um, you know, you're more than welcome to pop on a server with me. It's uh, it's all good. I've tried race room. Uh, I kind of like it. Um, again, the the art for the tracks. I'm always quite really impressed by textures and things like that because I do some of that myself. But um, the cars and the, they just they look great. Um, the only thing that I had to turn down on Razor Room was the sound of the squeaky cockpit. <laughs> I, could, I couldn't race him and go, <laughs> Is that like you jumping up and down on a bed? I, didn't, I couldn't, just couldn't race like that. Okay. Right, we've got last two keys. Um, I'm going to do those in 15 minutes. So the last two R Factor 2 keys, I'm going to do them uh, in 15 minutes. Yeah. And if I don't, then you can remind me to do it. Okie dokie. Now the only problem with race room is that it's it's kind of got the the i racing thing where you need money to be able to buy the content, and I just haven't got that expendable cash at the moment. Copy paste. Cool. Uh, it's because it's too long for Twitter. Oh, behave yourself. Too many dots in my tweets. There we go. Uh, right. Last two 